Hey guys, welcome back to another of my videos and today we are going to be doing a trading video which I have not done in like forever I also have not been posting a lot recently. So hi guys. I am not dead. I promise. All right Um, basically as you guys can tell by the title I decided to do a part two of what people trade for the parasol just because that I do believe is my most popular video Plus i'm kind of curious to see what people will offer now because I do think um, what the parasol is now worth has gone down. So I'm very, very curious to see what people will offer. So that's what we're doing today. Anyways, before we start the video, please make sure to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notification bell if you have not done so already. Anyways, let's start the video. Okay, so I'm in my fan server right now, and everybody's saying hi. Everybody's so nice. Oh, all right, I'm gonna see who wants to um, first trade me an offer. Okay, so we have this person offering for the parasol, and they put in the Dear Dolly corset, the traditional hand fan, and the Winter Guardian sleeves, along with 10,000. Um, for this trade, I do think they are, um, it's not a fair trade for me, personally, I would say. However, if they added a few more accessories that I was looking for, or diamonds, then it definitely could be um, a fair trade. It definitely is a start because I do like these accessories and the diamonds amount is pretty good, but I definitely would not accept this trade if I were truly trying to look to sell my parasol. <gasps> um, oh my god. Okay, <laughs> so this person, I just went into trade with this person, Mer Mermaid SPK, and the first thing I see, I like looked away from my PC for a second and they put in the Winter Halo 2020. <laughs> first of all, they are definitely overpaying. That is a Halo. I, I know a parasol can be worth a lot, but I would definitely have to add like a lot of stuff, a lot more stuff to get it to the worth of the Halo. I actually might, might bargain with them to see if I can get it because I kind of want the Halo. It looks very, very pretty. I want it. Okay, so she did take out the winter halo, but she also did offer the mermaid royalty and the this skirt. I also, th I think this probably also, in a sense, it could be a fair trade, or in some people's eyes, it could be overpricing as well. It depends what you're looking for, but I do think that this, um, in my perspective, it could be a fair trade, just because of the worth of those two items and the worth of the parasol. So yeah. Okay, guys. I'm forcing Seer to offer. <laughs> That's actually kind of mean. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so this is Serenity's offer. I think she placed the entire Fluttering Butterfly set. I could be wrong. And the entire Popstar set and the My Teddy Bear. To be honest, I think this would probably be overpricing on her end because like she's overpaying and that is very unfair. So if I were to accept this trade, I'd probably add something else in just to make it more fair because I don't remember how much this set costs. And I know it isn't in high demand, but still like just, you should reference it from the store as well. And the pop star set was free, but if you resell it, you probably could make a, you could make, you could make a lot because it was from an event and some people didn't do it. So it depends. I definitely think she is overpaying Serenity, which is very, very bad, but <laughs> it's a very good trade. Thank you. Before we continue on with the video, here's today's video shout out. If you guys want to be next video shout out, all I have to do is hit that like button, subscribe, and comment down as many times as you possibly can. Also, here's today's featured fan art. Thank you so much for drawing my OC. It looks absolutely adorable. I really, really love it. If you guys ever want to send it to me, make sure to tag me on socials or just simply join my Discord server. The link to that is always in my description down below. Anyways, though, I do want to interrupt and let you guys know about this game. I'm sure you guys have heard about it by now. This game is called Shopping Spree and it is made by Kate Ka and Evil. So make sure to definitely check it out. It's absolutely so, so fun. If you guys want me to do a whole video on it, I would love to. Also, speaking of the game, if you guys ever are thinking to buy coins with Robux, please make sure to use my promo code. All you have to do is type in Sienna, all lowercase, it's literally that easy, and just press buy. Also, by using my promo code, you get 10% more. So it's helping you guys out and helping me. You get more for what you're paying for. So definitely use my promo code. Anyways, guys, let's get back to the video. Okay, and you put in the parasol and say hello. <laughs> oh my wait, this person said by the way y'all sub to Sienna because she's amazing or else I take your cookies. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, you guys better sub or else this person's gonna steal all your cookies. <gasps> oh wait, oh they're putting oh okay. 
I'm gonna wait until they're done and then we'll review what they have in store. All right, so this person is done. Let's take a look at what they have. Okay, so they put in the um, Angeloid hair clips, like a lot of accessories here. We got some wings, more accessories. Ooh, okay, so some of these are free, but some of these are also from sets, which I do think if you if you actually take the time to add these up, they're probably worth a lot. Oh, they even put the Winter Guardian boots. So I'm not too sure what the parasol is currently worth. However, it definitely is down by a lot. If you compare this video to my previous parasol trading video, you'll definitely see a big change in difference with offers. I actually do think this is a pretty fair trade considering the OG price for the 2020 elegant parasol is like what? 60k they put in 40,000 diamonds and if you total all their accessories it's definitely more than 60k and i'd say the parasol you could sell around maybe 70 to 100k i don't know depends who your seller is and who is the buyer um and um yeah i think this is a pretty good trade not gonna lie like if I didn't have these accessories, I probably would accept it. I am sadly going to say no just because I'm not looking for accessories and I'm probably mainly looking for diamonds. But this is a very, very good trait. Alright, next person. Okay, so this person is finally done and... Alright, I, I don't know how to... God Bacon is me. Oh, that's their username. That's a very nice username. Okay, so it seems like they added in a lot of skirts. So we got the ballroom entrance, the cherry blossom skirt, Darling Valentina. Then they added in accessories as well. Ooh, the friendship necklace, right. I actually don't think I have that one. The jelly platforms, holding cute bunnies. Uh-huh, the manchetti bodice. Why did I say it like that? That's kind of weird. Um, <laughs> and then other accessories as well. And then on top of that, they added 23,000 um personally yet again it does depend on what you're looking for i tend to usually look for diamonds or items that i don't have however if you are looking for like items that they're offering then i definitely say that this this would be fair however i think it would be more fair if they added more diamonds to be honest just because yes these skirts can be pretty expensive and the accessories as well but some of these are free so you know, just just make sure for reference that it's fair. So I think it's kind of fair. If I were to accept this and I were looking for these ex accessories in particular, I'd probably ask them if they could add some more diamonds or give me an accessory that I'm specifically looking for. So that is my thoughts on this trade. Now let's move on to the next one. Alrighty, on to the next. <laughs> Wait, sub to Sienna or else. I like this person flossing in the background. Okay, I'm gonna accept somebody's trade. Um, let's do this person. Alright, so this person said that they're sorry if they can't offer as good as they want to, but that is absolutely okay. And um, they basically they put in parts of the new set, which I do think if I wait some time, I could probably resell it to be a lot later depending on the demand of course and who i'm selling it to but other than that this this these stuff are actually pretty expensive isn't like the isn't the skirt i don't remember what was fifty thousand? this is actually pretty good if like i said before if you are looking for the new set and like these other two skirts and you want a few diamonds i definitely think this is about fair maybe a few more diamonds but why why is my mouse glitching um um, okay. <laughs> Anyways, um, basically, I do think this is a pretty good trade. Yet again, I might ask them to add a few more diamonds if I were to actually want to do this trade. But I actually do think it's pretty fair because... Wait, I need to check. Are... I, I think... I think the new summer fantasy seashell sandals are like 50,000. So I just asked Serenity if the shoes are 50,000 and they are. So actually this would be a very fair trade. I take it back. I don't think this person needs to add any more diamonds just because the shoes are 50K and I would assume if I wait maybe a couple of months after this goes off sale, it could maybe retail for 60 to 70K. So, and a parasol is about that much. Also, yeah, I don't know. Would they be, is this overpricing for them? This is actually a pretty good trade. But yeah, that was a very detourish explanation of this offer. Sorry. 
badge time. Hehe. <laughs> okay, okay. I actually think that I went through enough trades today, and I really hope this video helps you guys. If you guys are looking to sell your parasol, yet again, I do think it has gone down. And for me personally, I feel like you could sell the parasol if it was to be fair for both sides. That you could sell it around to be the worth of either. 70,000 to 100,000 so that's in counting the accessories they put and diamonds so it depends what you're looking for again I really did like a lot of these trades like a lot of them were really really good so anyways that is it for today's video please make sure to hit that like button that subscribe button and that notification bell if you have not done so already and I'll see you guys next time goodbye <laughs>